Yo, welcome back. It's CR8 here, and we are back on some NCAA college football revamp, man. The RTG featuring Le'Veon Peterson, man. If you didn't take notice of the last episode, I kind of hinted at the end of the episode, episode one. You know, there was a Texas A&M, man. Gig em. I don't know what that means, but, you know, I'm just going with the storyline. Uh, you know, a lot of the colleges, three out of the four schools wanted this kid to play defense, and he's not about to play defense. So, you know what I mean? As a good diving catch by there right there by Jalen Preston, and he goes for 32 yards. Now, being that, we already, I think we are uh, like three or four weeks into it, man. We had to fight up to get up the depth chart. We was fourth, actually, on the depth chart. So, um, we won't get, we'll get playing time, but not that much, being that we are the third um, the wide receiver. And we're just going to make the most of it, man. Third and 13. And just by, you know, the thumbnail, you know, you already know what this episode is about, man. But third and 13 right here. I don't know if that was for me or the other receiver. But, yo, the QB has to get it together, man. We are one for three on third down. That's the most crucial down if you want to win a football game. Third and 19 right here. And I don't know what's going on with the quarterback. But it's looking ugly right now. That's the way to settle in, man. Jaden Widemeyer, he picks up 16. And it's second and 10, man. And we are taking on the Arkansas Razorbacks. And, you know, just a little side note, man. I don't know if y'all PS2 lovers, uh, you know, NCAA football for, uh, 11 and 06, they had actually had the 2021-2022 updated rosters on the PS2, man. So... I definitely will be playing that offline, you know what I mean? But second and five right here, we're entering to that goal, goal line. And right here, it's obvious, bro. Flip the play. <laughs> like, flip the play, second and five. Hand off to Isaiah Spiller, and it goes for negative two yards, man. We don't want to become a one-dimensional, just a pass-heavy offense, bro. Like, no. You got arguably the best running back in the SEC, let alone in the country. We don't want to give him five or ten touches a game. Like, nah. As you can see, the frustration is there. The frustration is there, man. It's a 3-3 ball game, and you know, we should have way more points than it shows. First and 10 play action pass. What will he do with it? Oh, let's go. Watermark with the catch, man. Let's go. He picks up 30. That's what we like to see, man. Third and three. Two for seven on third down. You can't win ball games like that. Third and three under a minute remaining in this second quarter. Play action pass. And yo, -hoo -hoo! good route. Let's go. Le'Veon Peterson, bro. Like this first college cat. If he did not step out of bounds, that definitely would have been a lot more yardage. And we actually take the lead. First and 10. Coach can call four verts, man. <laughs> he never fails. Four verts, man. First and 10. Pressure up the middle. And yo. Kazada, bro, you need protection, man. You definitely need protection. That sack gonna set up a second and 18. 155 remaining, man. Pass protection. You give him time, he gonna find somebody. Let's go. Let's go. Take that thing to the crib. <laughs> like, let's go. That's what we talking about, baby. Jalen President, 82 yard touchdown reception. And right now, we up by two scores, man. If the defense can hold strong, we will walk out of here with a W, man. You can see the safety blitz. And he, yo, <laughs> pass protection, man. Pass protection. But third and 13 right here, we still got to come to enough lead, man. Our defense is stepping up. Oh, we got him. We got you. Put a little more touch on that pass, man. You do that, Le'Veon is racing off to the end zone, man. And it's just like that. It's a one possession game, man. First and 10. Oh, we got him. Let's go. Let's go. His second catch of his college career. Let's go. Pick up of 26, baby. Let's go. And we jump up, man. We up by two scores. Oh, let's go. Damon Damas. I know that dude because he, you know, he's famous for that YouTube doing that back flip. You know what I mean? That's the only reason I know him, but 36, let's go. That boy was lost. 
<laughs> Yo, take a look at this. They had that boy on skates. He like, oh shit, he over there. I'm, he, when, when he realized he looked back, I'm already in the end zone, coach. Like, come on. First and 10 hand out to Isaiah. Yo. Like I said, we cannot give this guy. He got 22 rushing 46 yards, man. Arguably the best running back in the SEC, let alone in the country. Let's go. Watermeyer, let's go. He is having himself a game. Pick up of 30, man. First and 10, fourth quarter action. Let the big dog eat, man. Let the big dog eat. Let's go. That's what we talking about, man. That's what we talking about. Those are the kind of runs we want to see Spiller, you know, bring to this offense, man. First and 10. And I believe the second string wide receiver two got injured. So, as y'all, like I said, we was number three on the depth chart. Now we number two. So, I believe he, he was out for the game. So, we got to step in, man. Hopefully, we can show the coaches of, of you know, hey, we need to be starting. Man, I still put it on the ground. And luckily enough, we fall on it, man. That was a tough break for us, man. Third and goal. Now, let's definitely put this game in the bag right here. Good catch. Just not quite in the end zone, man. Now, I'm going to actually watch this because a lot of times they miss it. But the kick is up and the kick is good, man. And we more than likely will walk out of here with a W, man. Nice catch by Preston, bro. He is having himself a monster game. Pick up of 12 and a first down. Casada over 400 passing yards, man. That's good and all, but like I said, I don't want to be one dimensional. It's just a pass heavy offense right here. I don't know if he dropped that or what, but we walk out of here with a W, man. What a way to shine. What a way to, you know, deliver in his first college game, man. We scored in our first college game. It definitely feels good to walk out here with a W, man. And hopefully we show the coaches enough that, hey, this kid Peterson, we know they put him in the starting rotation, man, even though we are third on the depth chart. But it's CR8 here, man. Appreciate y'all. Love y'all to life until next time, man. I'm up out of here. Peace.